The project cited Earth's climate at your fingertips, connecting environmental sciences and the public through interactive uh, data exploration. And with this project, we aim to provide easy and intuitive access to global climate data to really empower more people to use this data for science and education. I've worked and collaborated closely with Sebastian to sort of bring professional software development techniques to his work. You can access this website, it works very well on mobile devices as well as desktop, laptop environments. Effectively it's a website and it's completely interactive. I hope that people are able to really explore and maybe even feel past and future climate change to be able to really understand how dynamic our Earth system was in the past but also to see how alarming our current warming is in this context. We're normally talking about climate change on timescales of millions of years, but we are currently talking about the same magnitude of climate change happening in the next decades. The visualization is made up of many layers and lots of information is combined within that. And one of the things that I can imagine the public being more interested in is moving the timeline maybe back to when they were born and seeing how much the climate has changed within their own lifetime. We tried this exhibition out at the COP26 to show people what these global climate targets mean for the local region or country where they live in and we got a great reception there and now we're trying to take these animations, this data to the JGI showcase to make this new tool accessible to even more people and show them how they can use the underlying data for their own decisions in the future.